to safety. Inside the centre circle, Coker delivers it short to Cav Miley. Miley now going forward on the left hand side for South End. Bridge is up with him. Bridge towards the edge of the area. Bridge for South End. Can he get the cross in? He does deliver it in. Goalkeeper Brooks, one of the three changes in the Rochdale side, and it's been won by Waldron on the edge of the area, but he fires over from 18 yards. South end, taken quickly by Taylor, gives it to Coker, crosses into the area, comes down to Waldron, edge of the box, opportunity, bridge, miss it just over the bar, remains 1 0 to South End. Here, South End United 1, Rochdale 0. As it stands, South and United won't be in the playoffs, but we'll see what happens. Here comes Rochdale into the area. Shot oh, is deflection. deflected. Just wide of the target. Out for a corner kick. And here is Brooks to play it down the spine of the pitch. Flicked onto the edge of the area. Opportunity for Rodney at the shot. That's blocked by Harry Taylor. The rebound has gone out onto the far side for Mitchell. Once again. Nevitt takes a throw in from halfway for Rochdale. Miley tries to get it away from him. Nevitt shields it and turns it back to Evank Landell. Out onto the far side, he's gone via Sassy and now Gordon. Uh, Rot uh, Chesterfield had also taken the lead in that sequence. It's Chesterfield 1, Maidenhead 0. Chesterfield, the champions, they'll be returning to the uh, Football League next season. Right hand side. Hayes, who's been a bit of a threat for Rochdale, moving away, good defending by Miley, and he gets it to East, Rochdale can build again, into Hayes in the area, good defending again by Miley, yeah, Hayes still, closer. Hayes still, and the shot hits the woodwork, bounces down, and gathered by Colin and D&D, &D. Morton's had to do it for him, we'll play four by Colin and D&D, &D. that's over the head of Cardwell, cleared away by Ebanks Landell, Straight down the middle. Taylor has been dispossessed by Hayes. Into the area. Hayes round the goalkeeper. Hayes converts. And South End United couldn't stop the big threat in this first half with four minutes until the interval to go. Kean Hayes bursting through and he locks it level for Rochdale. South End United 1, Rochdale 1. Yeah, unfortunately, Nick, this is what I said earlier. Molly Kinsdale every now and again just gets a little bit sloppy. Tries to look a good player when he hasn't really got the top. Could have just put his boot through it. United penalty area free kick Ryan East fires it into that box Ebanks Landell was up from the back just given by the referee Paul Johnson just inside their own half Rochdale taking 1-1 one, one at the moment Ebanks Landell to the left hand side to Nevitt Ebanks Landell again to Sassy forward by him Ralph defends but only as far as Edwards and here is Rodney, 25 yards out. Edwards back to Rodney! Right. Poor Devante hit. Rodney. Uh, kept him out for a, a little while, but uh, he's made a decent impression in his, in his first real season. It's all about learning. And uh, a good acquisition of the ball's played in behind. Opportunity for Mitchell to chase after. On the edge of the area, into the box. Mitchell for Rochdale. Has the shot. Wide of the target. Remains 1-1. 1-1 one, one it is at the moment here at uh, Roots Hall. 19 minutes of the second half gone. Corner kick taken by Bridge deep. Cardwell's header into the side netting. Closing people down and they were passing it past him and he was looking around no one was following him in. But he stuck at it. Henderson on. Used to play out the road didn't he at uh, Colchester in his time. He's played plenty of clubs as well. Left hand side, Nevitt, the other end of his Ball. career, into the penalty area, danger moments, immediately Henderson was nipping in there, by South, to South End United. There's Miley for the Blues, in his own back line, he's in a bit of trouble here. Edwards, Rodney turns, has a shot, takes a ricochet, another shot from 15 yards out. Has possession on the right hand side for the Blues. Taylor with a ball in towards the middle, towards uh, Cardwell, didn't find him. 
Hayes has cleared it away. Up the field it goes. Rodney's chasing after it. Rodney gets it past the goalkeeper and an injury time converts. And Rochdale, right at the death, have taken the lead. And Southend United's fight for a playoff place comes to an end. They're going down here at Roots Hall at the end of the season. Results not going for them elsewhere either. But what a season it has been. 2-1 at the moment here. But South End United have taken it all the way through to the last knockings. But they just couldn't quite get over the line. South End 1, Rochdale 2. Yeah, it's, uh, it's kind of ironic when you, when you watch Rochdale. I'm saying to go play for a half time.